the first step is about screen recording for example you are having a lecture or you are watching some kind of video and you want to take notes in the meantime so just bring your s pen closer to the screen and then press this s pen button so i will bring my pen closer and then i will press the s pen button it will open the air command and then from here i will select create note it will open the samsung notes and here you can start taking your notes now you can see this note taking app is blocking the view behind so what you can do is use your s pen press and hold it like this and then you can easily drag and drop here in the split screen now you can see the video and on this side you can continue your note taking the next thing is you can also use the screen recording option so you just have to bring your pen closer press the s pen button it will open the air command and then from here select screen recorder it will open the screen recorder and then press this red button and then after this countdown your screen recording will start the next thing is if you want to highlight anything important in your screen you can use this pen tool and then you can use your s pen and then you can highlight anything important in your screen the next thing is you can also turn on the front camera so first of all i will turn off this pen and then here is the front camera option so here you can see i turn on the front camera you can change its position as well the next thing is if you want to enter some kind of text in your screen you can also do it just select this t option so here it will open the text tool and then you can select any part of your screen and then you can write anything on your screen the next thing is if you want you can also take the screenshot so here is the screenshot option so you can press it like this it will take the screenshot and then it will save it automatically in your gallery once you finish with your screen recording you can select this stop option from here then it will ask you if you want to edit your screen recording you can select this yes option it will open the samsung studio plus but if you don't want to edit it you can select this no option and your screen recording will automatically save in your gallery so later you can access it you can edit it and you can share it the next step is about using your s pen for copy any text for example you are scrolling through a website and you find some interesting information and you want to save it so just use your s pen press and hold it like this and then start making the selection so for example i will select it till here and you can see this option of copy so i will select this copy option now you can paste it anywhere for example i will open samsung notes in split screen and now i want to paste it here so i will press and hold it like this and here you can see we have this text available so i can just select it and you can see the same text that i copy is now available in my notes and later if you want you can also edit it and if you want you can also use the highlight if you want to highlight the text you can also use your pen if you want to write something with your s pen the next step is about smart select tool for example you are scrolling through a website and you want to capture some specific part of this website you can use smart select tool bring your s pen closer to the screen press the s pen button it will open the air command and then from here you can use this smart select tool then you can use your s pen and start making your selection so for example i want to select this image so i will select it like this now you can see the image is selected now if you want you can use this pen tool if you want to write something and once you finish with your editing you can also pin this image so i will close it from here and you can see we have this pin option so i will select it like this so the same image will be pinned to my screen now even if i close this website you can see the same image is available the next thing is you can also use this image for example i open my notes and now i want to bring this image to my notes i will use my s pen and i will press and hold it like this and then i can drag and drop it here in my notes 
So here you can see the same image is available in my notes and here if you want you can edit this image if you want to write something you can write over here and once you finish with your editing you can save it and you can share it. The next tip is about using your S Pen for PowerPoint presentations. So here you can see I open the web version of Microsoft PowerPoint and here I open my slides. I will select this present option and then here you can see we have different tools available. I will select this drawing tools and the first option is laser pointer. So I will select it. Now I can use my S Pen as laser pointer. So here you can see I can highlight anything important in my presentation. The next thing is you can also use it as a pen. So I will select this pen tool and now I can write anything on my PowerPoint presentation. The next thing is you can also use it as highlighter. So if you want to highlight anything important, you can also use your S Pen as a highlighter. The next option is eraser. So if you want to erase something, you can also erase anything in your PowerPoint presentation using S Pen.